was 18 years old and I knew I wasn't going to college, so I pretty much taught myself how to drive. What I like about driving is the freedom. I get my instructions where to go, when to be there, and, and I do it. And um, don't need anyone to hold my hand. I, I know what I'm doing. I just love driving. What you need to know about driving a truck is you never forget your height, weight, length, the room you need to turn. All these skills take a lot of time to learn. I don't care how long you've been driving, you learn something new every day. It's been fun, I've, but I've had to put up with a lot of crap. But I feel like if I can't do the job, that includes loading, unloading, breaking up doubles, I shouldn't be out here and I could always do the job. You get tested all the time. People always testing you, see if you know what you're doing. You need to know how to back up, not run and get somebody to back up the truck for you, the trailer. Back in the day, there weren't facilities for women out there. No showers, you had to use the men's showers that maybe didn't have a lock on the door. I'd go into a restaurant and they'd automatically put down two cups of coffee they assumed you couldn't be by yourself. I used to have to even change my clothes in the cab, laying down in a sleeper cab that was only as wide as my own shoulders. My mother was a single mom raising four teenage girls and she was a factory type worker. Always wanted to be union till she finally got into a union position and she was able to be shop steward and that made a big impact on me. I wanted to be union to get equal pay, a pension, and benefits. Truckers are required to stay in the two right-hand lanes. Of course, they're the most heavily traveled, so we need more construction to make the lane safer. I've been on roads so rough that it throws me out of my lane. We need to do something to fix these potholes that we have to run in because it's, it's just unsafe. The growth in San Bernardino and Riverside counties has grown so much in the last, say, 40 years I've been here. The port trucks, they're coming in off the ships and the rail yards. Everywhere you look are containers. We really need to upgrade these freeways and the infrastructure for trucks. Safety is absolutely number one. And we need people to understand what we need to do our jobs. When I'm driving surface streets in the city, I have to watch for low clearances. For instance, the turn I'm going to make right now, I have to swing wide and make sure I have enough room to miss the light poles and things like that and cars. Just a million things. Uh, dead end streets. Your, your eyes are always moving all the time to where, where you can and cannot be. Break one nine for traffic check on the 91 going from Riverside to Corona, please. I'd like to see the Amazon truck drivers organized. They'll have more pride in their jobs. They'll get better pay, pension, benefits, everything. It can only get better for them. And same for the production workers in the warehouse. They need to be organized and union. People might think this is an unskilled trade, driving trucks like this. But it takes a lot of skill, a lot of skill, a lot of practice. It's an art. It's an art to drive a truck and to do it well.